Hello guys, welcome back to our Let's Play. We are here on the world, um, right over here is the Sunflower Plains as you saw in last episode. We were going to build in those, and last episode you also saw that we found a, a mob spawner right down in here. You know, I, I decided I am going to build the mob spawner into my house. Um, so I came over here where, let me check this real quick, okay. Came over here where the mob spawner is, and we're going to be building our house in this little area. Because if I like sunflowers so much, I might as well, I can just bring them over here. It's not that hard. But, I've also thought, this looks cool. I, li I mean, it, I guess it's cool, but I like how it, um, in Pocket Edition, you actually set your chests right next to each other. And they both do the works and everything. So, also, I have been messing around with hardened clay, as I said. And, um, I have decided that I will not be using light blue also known as, what is that also known as? Just light blue? Yeah, okay. I will not be using that for my clay. I am going to be using yellow. Yeah, yellow. <laughs> uh, I have decided this because I think it looks actually amazing. Let's go ahead and give it a try. Um, as you can see, I got some sunflowers. I'm going to try not to use as many sunflowers as I can. Um, yeah, so, oh my gosh. Oh, that sucks. I didn't know it takes that much clay to make that. Huh. Wow, you get a lot, though. Holy crap. Eight times? Oh, well, that makes sense. Oh, okay. Never mind. We're getting our money's worth. Okay, so it takes eight around, as you can see, the dandelion there, but you get eight back. I was about to say, that's a ripoff. Wow, look how much stained clay we have now. Oh man, yeah, but look how good that looks. I'm using that for our build now. Um, let's go ahead and check out what we got here. We need that. I stored my tools away because I was carrying all my stuff over here, as you can see. I need uh, need some food. But before we start on the house, I'm going to put this away. We are getting started on the mob spawner. It would make sense because i got to make the, the uh, elevator come out of the ground and... Um, that is obviously going to be an important role in finding out where it's going to go. So we need a lot of cobble. Let me think. One, two, three. One, two, three. We need to make some more sticks. <laughs> oh boy. I'm going to cut it a lot in this uh, episode because mob spawners are a hefty job. Wait a minute. I should be able to make another one. Probably need more sticks. Yep. All right. What else can we make? There's all kinds of cool things. I mostly forgot all of it because, obviously, I'm trying to think. Because you have to have the item to know what to craft. Hey, buddy. So, let's go ahead and get started on this. So, I got basically main supplies. No, I do not. Do I still got iron? No, I do not. We are going to need, uh, let's see. I'll get another six. Doing this because we're going to create buckets. We need to make an infinite source, like right around here somewhere. No, actually, we need to bring it down there with us. Hey, what do you know? We got some water. Everything's just working out well for us today. <laughs> I'm really liking it. I don't know how long this episode's going to be, guys, because I have work here in a little bit. Um, I work at KFC, guys. KFC. Yeah. That crappy place. No, I'm just kidding. It's not crappy, but... Uh, okay, let's do this. Nah. Should've... Uh, crap. Do I have enough on me? No. Going back up. Sorry, guys. <laughs> we need some ladders to help us get out of here in case. Oh, this is gonna be a fun project, I can tell already. So, um... I, actually, I may just cut it here, actually, for you, for your viewing pleasure. I'm going to go ahead and create some of these. You can't tell how much you're creating. That's the bad thing. You have to keep exiting out. Where's on my sticks option? Oh, right there. <laughs> I lost it. Okay. Now ladders. Oh, you get. Oh, you can make 14. Gosh dang it, that always fools me. Okay, 20. No. <laughs> Sorry. 28. That looks good enough. Now. I'm going to go down here, dig it out with you guys, and then start doing the basics. So this should be, hopefully I got a sword on me. 
Oh, man, because you know, once I break them torches, all them zombies are going to go after me. This is going to be fun. Oh, what was that? I heard like a noise. Uh, it sounds like something was burning lava. I think I'm just tripping. Okay. <laughs> oh, man, how far down is this? Hopefully the zombies will spawn in it when I'm at the house. Oh, phew, just in time. Alright, so this is quite a small room we got here, so we're going to go ahead and clear all the cobble that's already in it, which I'm going to cut it here actually. I'm going to go ahead and clear it all out and uh, get the basic formation of it and uh, get the areas ready for water. Um, crap, I need signs too. What's pushing me? Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Go away, I don't have my sword. Oh. He was pushing me for a second, what's that? Oh boy. I'm actually going to block this off. Uh, this is going to be a crazy project. Well, it's not going to be crazy. It's just I don't want to die during it. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to try to do the best I can clearing it out. And um, I'll get you guys back in here as soon as possible. So, be right back. Alright guys, I basically got it cleared out so far. I got my water source placed down to get ready to start flooding the area. Um, right now I don't have the correct dimensions down, I don't believe. I did, uh, three away from the spawner on each side, which I think was the sort of, hey, a loud truck going by, sorry guys. Um, let me think, that truck's kind of threw me off. <laughs> Alright, so, I think, uh, the area I dug out, which is going to be right here, our hole we dug down is right there, I think this needs to go, I don't know why I did that. So, I, I keep forgetting. Now, this is going to be a problem because the mobs are going to spawn. Oh, my lord! Does every truck have to go by as loud as they can? Um, let's see. I might have to go in one because you have to go down one. Well, at least for my design, you have to. Like so, I forgot how long these water blocks are. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That should be enough. I think they're eight blocks. If I could remember correctly. God, I hate auto jump so much. Oh man. Now get ready for. Actually, I'm pretty sure it is eight blocks. I'm going to trust that it's eight blocks. If not, then we might be screwed. But I'm not going to lay out the water until. I'm done carving out everything. There we go. So water blocks go all in there. Flow all the zombies towards this way. They go into this little drain. Water flowing this way. Another water flowing this way, which will flow them into a room such as... Let me think here. How should I do this? Yeah, it should be fine. We're going to go into this right here. Yep. Alright, and then I'm going to dig up all the way right here and start placing signs and water, which is not going to be fun, especially on Pocket Edition. I'm going to go ahead and lay this water out here. Um, Alright, looking good. I liking it. I like it. <laughs> I liking it. So, actually, I don't know. That might be a bad idea. That'll get on my nerves. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut it here and finish off. Why do I have two water buckets? What the heck? I just filled one in, but okay. Oh man, I need to make signs. Yeah, so I'm going to lay out all the signs here, dig all the way up. Um, I'm Actually, I'm going to dig all the way up and then... I'm trying to think as I'm talking. Sorry. Yeah, I'm going to place the signs down and all the water in between the clips so I won't bore you guys to death. You guys basically know the idea here of how to do this. Um, it's basically, I'm kind of doing a small tutorial for you guys in the episode, but, you know, I need to cut it at some points for exceptions. Alright, so I'm going to cut it, and I'll be right back with you guys. So, uh, I just had a memory leak for the first time ever, uh, when you got that message across the screen that says, not enough memory or something like that. That has to do with, uh, RAM memory. 
just let you know so you don't you don't delete anything you don't delete any worlds or nothing if it says that to just let you know that means you're out of RAM which is inside your device which is like a processing thing that holds like information and stuff it's hard to explain but yeah I just had that and I turned to look I think it's because I've been literally playing for the longest time making this on all full graphics. I forgot I had all the render distance, everything. I literally turned all the graphics down low. I'm going to see what it looks like, every single one. Uh, but this is almost done. Um, I think, can I get out of this? Uh, please, I went out. I'm going to break this block for now. There we go. How does it look? Oh, wow. Ew, it looks plain. <laughs> As you can see, I don't have fancy graphics on. I don't have animated water. I turned the render distance all the way down. I turned clouds off. But this is just for now. Don't worry, we're not going to be playing like this forever. He just submit. I just read a tweet. He just submitted the bug fix update to Apple. So the memory leak stuff should stop here pretty soon. I'm going to go ahead and throw some stuff away. Now that I got the basic area where the farm is going to come up, we are going to get building on the house, finally. Oh my god. Every truck goes by my house. It's funny because I look back at my videos and you can barely hear it, yet you guys hear me complain about it all the time and I just make myself look stupid. But, yeah, let's go to bed real quick. <sighs> yeah, um, I noticed a flaw. A flaw that might be a big flaw. A flaw that's a flaw. And that is. Okay, I need to plug this up before someone falls down and dies. Flaw. Where is it? I'm lost. Okay. This is really high up. <laughs> if you haven't noticed, the farm is way down there. So far down there. And, uh... Oh, I want to make one of those. Here we go. <laughs> the farm is so far down there, I'm afraid when I'm up at my house, it might not be spawning mobs, so it's kind of useless. So if it happens to do that, I'm just going to end up uh, just making a basement or something that goes further towards the spawner. But for now, we're putting this on hold. I just wanted to get the basic area of where it's going to come out of the ground at. So uh, I can start building my house. Okay, that wasn't that deep. We need a shovel. Uh, hang on, I was checking if my time was recording. Okay, we need a shovel. Um, I hate these graphics. I think we can turn on a couple. I mean, gosh, Dallas. Let's see, so I'm going to turn that on one just for now. We can have beautiful skies on. I'm going to take fancy graphics off for now, though. I just kind of... You should always have beautiful skies on no matter what. It's, no, I can't even play without those. <laughs> uh, what was I going to say? Don't know. All right, we need a shovel. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> Iron. There we go. So we, now we can get some dirt, and then, yeah, I really need to do a lot of landscaping here. I need my land to look nice. Oh, we have a cave right there, I didn't even notice. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting about farms too. Okay, we got a lot to think, I'm sorry if I wasn't talking there, I, got a lot, I was thinking a lot like what kind of projects, we might have to make a project board where we write down tasks and whatnot. Um, let me get rid of this little line right here. Actually, I don't know if I need to get rid of this or not. Actually, I do. I need to get rid of a lot of this because my house is kind of going to be offset, or not offset, it's going to be kind of lifted off the ground a bit by some logs. I have this design in mind. I've seen it somewhere, but I don't know. I have to see how it looks. Hey, buddy. Now this, you are going to have to go. Oh, there goes my sign. Yeah, look how far that goes down. That's insane. Oh, gosh. I keep wanting to fall down that. Uh, I'm just going to plug it all up. And same as over here. Don't you just love landscaping, guys? Whoa, what is this back in here? Whoa! That is really cool. I'm going to have to do something with that, considering I live right next to it now. You remember that in my 0 0.8.1 series? I built a house on one of those. <laughs> Funny. Now, I know you guys don't 
probably enjoy landscaping a whole lot, but I'm going to go ahead and kind of just, I'm trying to get this done really quick, tear this back a bit so I can get the basics of my house set down. Just the floor plan, I guess you can say. Now, um, I'm also going to have a, it's not going to be automatic, obviously, because we don't have redstone. I'm going to have it in my house, a little chicken cooker. Uh, I, I need to think of a design first. I'm pretty sure I can come up with one really easily. Um, where it cooks chickens automatically for me, and I'll show you guys how to do it. And yes, I said automatically. You may have to put the chickens in there yourself with eggs as they lay them, but the cool thing is, I can. you might know how to do it, but I know how to make an automatic chicken cooker, which is really awesome. And I'm going to do that inside my house, so I can just walk by for some food sometime. Now, we need sand really badly. I hope we have sand nearby. Is it going nighttime already? Jesus, where's that sun? You stay up there, buddy. Did I not collect any sand in my adventures? Where could sand... Oh, do I see sand over there? Yeah, oh, there's actually sand right here. Like six, eight blocks or so. <laughs> I'm going to grab over here, go over here and grab some because I'm going to be using a lot of, and I mean a lot of sand on my... Uh, build. Oh, I forgot to complete. Uh, all right. Um, yeah, if I didn't tell you this when I was adventuring around a bit over here. I don't know if it'll load in or not. Uh, way over those, that tree line right there. No, it's not going to load in way over that tree line. You see ahead there is like, a. I can't think it's a village. <laughs> That's what it was called a village. Yeah, there's a village over there, and I'm going to try to bring some of the villagers over here. Okay, I could have swore I saw... Okay, I passed it up. Yeah, there's a village over there. I'm going to try to bring some villagers over to... There's no point, but um, I really want to know if... Since normal mobs... Not mobs, normal like mobs like sheep or cows or pigs don't respawn, I want to test if those don't respawn, and if they don't... I think I'm going to, like put them all in incubators in there just because I can I'm gonna have like a, a floor on my house my house I'm planning to make my house kind of tall actually and I thought that would be kind of a, like a little fun aesthetic thing to put in <laughs> you know just fun stuff that's what I plan to do on this series all the time though all kinds of fun things did my, sho my shovel broke man you did not last that lot I can't believe we don't even have any diamonds yet. I'm going to have to go strip mining off uh, in between episodes. Y'all know how fun strip mining is. There's some clay. How much we got? Almost a stack. That'll work for now. Um, Let me... Where's my furnaces? I, I don't think I have... Oh, okay. They're still over there. Well, okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm just sitting here talking to myself. This thing right here, I'm going to make this come up with glass around it and um, my house will be right here and then I'm gonna landscape some more of that out of the way I need to go grab my furnaces real quick I think it's just right over this hill hey buddy you just chilling oh there's a creeper too they said they uh, upgraded the spiders a lot but I'll tell you what they're way more stupid than I've ever seen like I, I just don't even get him most of the time like that you saw how he literally just jumped right on top of me right there and he didn't even die or I didn't even take any damage uh, see if you stand in one place killing the creepers it's super easy now oh my god where's my oh pff, I can't believe I left my furnaces over here I'm sorry babies I'm gonna grab you I'm gonna grab some of y'all too Just for the build. Come on now. There we go. Now it's going nighttime, isn't it? Whoa, I had gold. And iron. Holy crap. 44. Jesus, I can't believe I left all that over here. My gosh. 44 iron and how much gold? 16 gold. Jeez. 16 gold, that's like a lot of powered rails. Oh man, if I would have forgot about that. I was thinking about just going ahead and making a new furnace and leaving those over there. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't do that. Now, we can actually start on the house now. Even though episode is about to end. Um, this is just a little... I, I guess this just can be a little, you know. 
a mob farming episode, not mob farm, of making of the mob farm episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm not ending it quite this second. <laughs> quite this second. Nice one, Dallas. Now, of course I don't have any wood. Did I? Oh, I turned it all into that stone stuff. Not stone. Fences. Not fences. Signs. Jeez. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm going to grab some trees real quick and do the basic layout of my house. What? Is that a random log? Oh yeah, that's the falling down trees, isn't it? Oh, I'm going to take you. A little stump. Yeah, I don't like these graphics whatsoever. I'm going to start playing on fancy graphics. It's just that... That's, I'm just surprised that the iPhone 5S did that. It had a memory leak, supposedly, and these things, like, iPhone 5S's have a lot of RAM. Like, a lot. You know, like, a lot of gigabytes worth of RAM. I know that for sure. Oh, boy. Oh, loud motorcycle. Hey, buddy. Okay. Now, this is why... Okay, just stop. That's why I'm installing, when I can, this sprinting mod. I am tired <laughs> of walking around so slow. It's just terrible. I don't get how you guys or anyone else can deal with it. It's just, I don't, that's a must-have feature. I mean, you think they can probably code double-tapping the forward button and then you sprint. But then again, they would have to code in hunger and whatnot for that, but... They could have at least, since we don't have hunger yet, coded in a, a limited sprint. It like lasts for a certain amount of time, and then you have to wait to, to like recharge or something. I don't know, something. Because now that we got in these infinite worlds, it's so crazy just to walk all that way. And You know what I mean, it's unbearable. I don't like it at all. Yay, more landscaping. No. <laughs> I'm going to... See all this right here? I'm going to get rid of all of this stuff right here that you see. All that cliff stuff. I don't... I hate it. I want... I like flat open land. Now, um... The glass is going to come up. Yay, another motorcycle! Hey! Jesus. See, this, this is what my life revolves around. Motorcycles, tractors, and trains. That's all. Now, um... I have no idea how I'm going to do this, guys. I'm gonna have to do that in between episodes. I had no, I can't just walk into something like that and just expect to build. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. Ooh, flowers. Um, like if you guys enjoyed, as always. Um, these are the tall ones. Yeah, I'll put out another episode. This is going, this might go out tonight because I put on my video. If it gets a decent amount of likes, I'll throw this one out at like 10 or 11 o'clock on episode three. I said that in my comments. So. This might go out tonight or tomorrow morning, and that kind of matters, as I said, amount of likes and stuff. If you guys really want to watch it, you guys would like it. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later.